Time now for Top Shots, presented by Atlantic City. And he now has got to be a guy, when you talk about the, the studs in the, in the, on this tour in the sport, oh, he's got to be in that conversation oh, every yeah, single time. Absolutely. You cannot look past him in a bracket. See what kind of swing he's got today. But that ball's climbing. I mean, 212 in ball speed, but well over 3,000, 3,300 RPMs right here. All right, so that's out north of 310. This driver does not look like a full 48 inches, which is the USGA max. It just looks a little shorter to me. I know he's a very tall player, and let's see what he brings to the tee in the semis. Uh, that might be one and done right there. That's a very flat ball. Yes. Well, he was one and done in the quarters. Yes. And oh, he yeah. is one and done again. Two swings, two wins, and Timber is in the finals. Final ball for JJ. Was that a gust, Jerry? It was, and it's more than a gust right, right. now. It's actually <laughs> it'd be tough to land an airplane in this right now, dead into the wind. So he resets, reloads. That Just too has much. a chance. A little too much climb. Here we go. 326. And too much climb. Short of 320. This is uncharted territory right here for Will Hope because the minimum was dropped. Let's see what he can do here. Uh, he just did it. Yeah. Well, it's over. That will take yeah. care of business right there. How about going up there and thinking about bunting it <laughs> and going 139? You know what? In this win, if you go over 300, you deserve a hashtag. Mash him up. Absolutely. Great golf swing there under control. Love it. Kyle wants to be number one, and he's focused on Justin James. Justin wants to win the tournament. He's focused on Justin James. That's it, not its opponent. Kyle Berkshire is the youngest hitter out here. He has made it to the finals of the first two events in Auction and then at Fort Jackson. Beaten by Tim Burke, beaten by Ryan Stamper, and how about that? Yeah. The longest drive of the day.